Hello and welcome to our Teacher Spotlight series where we interview staff here at Greystone. This week's interview is dedicated to Mr. Honeycutt. He enjoys listening to music, cycling, and gaming with his friends. Clubs he helps run or runs here at Greystone include Quiz Bowl for the high school, middle school, and student council. Now on to our interview with Mr. Honeycutt. What is your name and what do you teach here? I am Mr. Honeycutt. I teach various different social studies classes. This year I teach AP Seminar, AP Euro, and Honor Civics. What college or university did you go to? I went to Wake Forest. How many years have you been teaching? Thirteen. What inspired you to be a teacher? Uh, I knew I wanted to do something with history. I didn't know what I wanted to do. Um, so I was kind of exploring options and my sophomore year I took uh, an education course mm -hmm. and part of that course was we had to have 20 hours of observation in a local school that we were interested in so I, I chose high school mm -hmm. um, so I had to have 20 hours of observation at Mount Tabor High School in Winston-Salem and the 20th hour 19 hours of observation the 20th hour was we had to teach class and so I got to teach Columbian Exchange to an AP World History class and I absolutely fell in love with it and it's like this is what I'm doing Mm -hmm. And I knew. Cool. Uh, what would you say your favorite parts about teaching the courses you teach are? They each kind of have different mm -hmm. um, things that I like about them. Um, seminar, I like watching the kids go and, and find stuff and research stuff and, and kind of become experts on whatever it is that their, their, uh, their topics are that they choose um, and kind of coaching them through that process. Um, civics is, um, is interesting because it's, it's, I don't want to say it's a rote memorization class, but there's a lot of that. So again, coaching, helping to, to understand what's going on. We're in our local government unit right now. Mm -hmm. And um, it's been really interesting to see like switches click of like, hey, wait, I actually know the county manager or um, just seeing that there is some type of connection to all this government stuff we talk about, especially as we get smaller down. That's pretty cool. Euro is really fun to teach to watch just how excited the kids get about it over the course of the year. So, like, you know, you had Euro, so we're in that point now. We're in that third quarter, and the nationalism is strong, and they're becoming very patriotic about their countries they've been assigned. And it's just fun to sit back and watch them argue over whose country is better using all sorts of historical justification that they've learned over the course of the year to explain why their country is better than somebody else's. It's just fun. Yeah. Uh, what would you say your favorite historical figure is? I love me some Otto von Bismarck. Mm -hmm. I love me some Otto von Bismarck. Um, and we're not supposed to like crooked politicians, but I love a good crooked politician. Mm -hmm. And then what is your favorite part about Greystone? My favorite part about Greystone as a teacher is that this is my kingdom. This room is my kingdom. And I basically have free reign to do what I want with certain limitations. Um, and I'm not going to be pushed by administration to change what I teach or how I teach as long as I'm getting results. Um, and so that autonomy is really valuable. Thank you for letting me interview you. No problem. Thank you.